If y'all found out Aphex Twin wrote the soundtrack to Jeffrey Epstein's suicide, you'd all be like, he's such a genius. I just found out that before God goes to sleep at night, he gets down on his knees, bows his head, and prays to Aphex Twin. What was that first joke? I'm trying to understand. Did you say Aphex Twins? What did you say? Aphex Twin. It's a, he's a wonderful artist. This guy gets it right here. Aphex Twin. And what is that? What kind of art is that? He does music. Okay. By round of applause, be honest. How many of you knew who Aphex Twin was? <laughs> Interesting. A new study suggests 63% of people on their deathbed hear music, and in 100% of those cases, it's Aphex Twin. All right, another Aphex Twin joke. I've been sneaking those in for a month now. I've been trying to. Do you still hate them? I mean, I still don't know what they are. Aphex Twin, he's just a wonderful uh, recording artist. Archaeologists recently discovered that the final animal to board Noah's Ark was an Aphex Twin. <laughs> Religious scholars have long dispelled conspiracy theories that Jesus Christ had a brother. However, archaeologists recently dug up evidence that God may have had a second son that Jesus may have had a twin named Aphex. <laughs> Debuting a new Aphex twin joke here. I know, did you know that's how that one was gonna end up? No, I never saw that coming. I know, I tried to put some misdirection in there so you wouldn't know, because I know how much you dislike the Aphex twin jokes. Well, I think you dislike the Aphex twin jokes because you don't do any when you're not on Kill Tony. I know. I don't know why that is. <laughs> Gustavo Arnall, the CFO of Bed Bath & Beyond, jumped to his death this past weekend in Manhattan, allegedly due to fraud. But I think we all know it's because Aphex Twin hasn't released a full-length LP since 2014! <laughs> Gustavo fucking loved Aphex Twin! He hasn't released an LP since 2014! Come on! <laughs> Thanks for my dad. My dad's here tonight. What the fuck? I actually uh, just set up an Etsy shop, everybody. I'm selling merch on my Etsy shop. This is pretty much what all the shirts look like, what I'm wearing right now. It doesn't have my name on it at all. It's just all Aphex Twin stuff, so if y'all can... Please visit my Etsy shop. I have 2,000 of these Aphex Twin shirts. I spent $10,000 on 2,000 Aphex Twin shirts. I'm starting to think it was a horrible idea. It doesn't have my name on it anywhere. Okie dokie. Uh, no, I'll be very honest with y'all. I don't even know who the fuck Aphex Twin is. It's just a thing that I started doing, and it's an easy way to get a laugh. I don't even fucking know who the guy is. Whoa. So y'all probably heard by now, Jay Leno was seriously burned in an accident inside of a car garage. <laughs> Investigators initially thought it was a gasoline fire, but they now have learned he was listening to an Aphex Twin mixtape. Trump is getting arrested. I mean, he got fingerprinted, mug shots, and they even gave him an anal cavity search where they weirdly enough found confirmation that Aphex Twin will be performing at the upcoming coronation of King Charles III. <laughs> Donald Trump will appear in a federal court next Monday after being accused of illegally hoarding classified documents. When asked about the felony charges, Trump responded, the only person who should be getting felony charges right now is Aphex Twin for performing live for the first time this past weekend in Denmark and not America. Aphex Twin! Aphex Twin! Aphex Twin! Aphex Okay, okay. All right, William Montgomery, everybody. Unbelievable.